where the uh, bag limit is. Oh, shit, there you go. Oh, yes, yes. Don't even know where that came up. Oh, oh my goodness, another razor. These ones are big suckers. Look at this. Oh, 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 oh yes. We only deal with big razor fish now because we know how much effort it takes to open and clean the, the things. Give you a rest. Here we go. Surely. Dave. Oh, there it is. There it is. Oh, sh there we go. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah. Now let him go. Goodbye, Krabby. Yeah, he's just. Oh. See, doing the right thing. Leave it to play for another day. No, no, no. no don't, don't come near don't us. All right. All right. Changing of the guards. Yeah, well, you get to video now. Oh, God. Oh, there you go, there we go. Oh, oh, gotta catch it, gotta catch it. It's a, it's a, it's a. Oh, yep, oh, get in there. It's three different colours. Three different colours. Okay, now there are three. We only got one yesterday. Get it out for me. Oh, look at that. That's a massive one. Alright, that's what we want. Just sit there. Look at that. There she goes. Here it comes. Oh sh oh sh Good morning. We're at Parara Campground. It's on the York Peninsula and um, it's just gone seven o'clock and look what we have in the background. We here to watch the sun rise. You can see it from our rooftop. It's pretty cool. And we're loving this spot. As you can see, the water level is see it in the background. Oh yeah, it comes all the way up to the Wee and it goes out for kilometers. Yesterday we raked for crabs. We had to walk for ages, but we got some. Really exciting and some razor fish which we actually cooked up they're like little scallops and they taste a little bit like chicken sort of consistency but they were all super awesome not a big feed but um in the end it's just fishing and the crabs were amazing they're so sweet so there's our sunrise might go back and make myself a coffee because that's what makes the world better Okay, so we've had a hiccup along the way. Stopped to get some groceries and found that there was grease inside the, what was it? Oil. Oil where? In the wheel hub. And we've done the bearings. Took it off, chucked it up, took the tire off, and we need to replace the bearings. Okay, so the, we're up early because luckily enough our friends are here to take Warren in to get some new wheel bearings. have been into town this morning bearings and seals Ryan's doing a bit of bush mechanics setting it all up not so much bush not so much bush a lot of know-how there a lot of grease that's going to be a good clean up but has to be done sandy a little bit of uh maintenance along the road but she's done so well how many kilometers do you reckon we've done so far uh, I don't know, a couple thousand three i reckon we're up to three thousand yeah about three thousand k so she's doing well the old girl she just needed a bit of tlc 
replacing the bearings and the hub. And we've got a spare for the other side if it goes kaput as well. All right, well, I'm leaving you to it because I'm going crabbing. We bought a crab rake and everything. Wish me luck. Are you going to wish me luck? Wish good luck. <laughs> so here we are, tyres back on, new bearings, new hub, and Warren, the maestro, looks like he's given Sandy a new lease of life. Is it spinning well? I can. Awesome. Take it from Bill. Right, we've just found this random big tree in the middle of the campground. We're here to pick some figs to go with our seafood. So I thought I'd show you this. Not only is there a place to recycle cans and bottles, but they've put suggested people put a container with some water, a stick and a rock to help the bees out. Look, just get a load of that. How many bees are there? And they're thirsty. So they're coming, having their water. And the best thing is there's a place to recycle the cans, which we've found in some campgrounds. And I was impressed to find it here.
Magazine Bay is nestled between a short cliff face on all sides. The sand is actually small pebbles, washed smooth by the constant lapping of water. It's great, they say, to squirt off the rocks, as well as a lovely sheltered place to swim. But first you have to climb these, this down these stairs that are incredibly steep, but well built. There's a cave at the rear of the bay. It's actually halfway up the cliff face. Amazingly, explosives were kept in this cave for a quarry, which the Point Turton Caravan Park now sits, prompting its name, Magazine Bay. <laughs>